A strong message from the head of the Mossad spy agency on this day. David Barnea says Israel will reach the depths of Iran and also the heart of Tehran direct. He says Israel has thwarted 27 Iranian terror attacks this year alone. He was speaking at the Institute for Anti-Terrorism Policy at Reichman University on Sunday, outlining Israel's concerns that Russia will send advanced weapons to Iran. His comments coming days after an event commemorating the 50th anniversary of the Yom Kippur War, in which Barnea said Israel should not underestimate the importance of unity in the country, adding that Israel's strength is its inner unity. Here are some of his latest comments in recent hours. We have to recognize the truth. Iranian terrorism continues because the Iranian regime still sees it as effective to achieving its ultimate goal, which is to preserve the rule of the Ayatollahs. The regime will continue this as long as no price is exacted. Just this year, together with our partners in the Israeli intelligence community and around the world, we thwarted 27 terrorist attacks that were planned to be carried out against Jews or Israelis all over the world. I'm talking about squads that were captured and weapons that were seized. I'm talking about the fact that there was a target and there was clear intention. I'm talking about the whole world, Europe, Africa, Southeast Asia and South America. Mossad director David Barnea on Sunday warned Iran's leaders that they would pay a direct price if Israelis or Jews are harmed in what he said was an ongoing, significantly stepped-up, state-organized Iranian terror effort worldwide. He said the terror campaign was being carried out in accordance with a political directive by the leader, an apparent reference to Iran's supreme leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei, and threatened the Iranian leadership in response. Fortunately for Iran, their terror efforts have been thwarted, he said. Why fortunately for them? Because thus far, we have only got to the operatives and those who dispatched them. If Israelis or Jews are harmed, however, Israel's response would go all the way to the highest echelon. Israel's response would go all the way to the highest echelon. Ukrainian intelligence says that Russia launched Iranian attack drones on ultra-Orthodox in the Ukrainian city of Uman. Ukrainian forces say they shot down more than 10 Shahid-136 drones in the south of the country that were launched from occupied Crimea. And special forces say they're convinced the attacks against Israelis were one of the conditions to Russia from Iran on the transfer of those drones. But the Israeli ambassador to Ukraine says that he did not see any signs of a deliberate attack on the pilgrims from Russia. It's estimated that more than 23,000 Israelis arrived in the Ukrainian city for a religious pilgrimage despite warnings from authorities.